SampleKings.com, your Kai MPC Studio instructional DVDs. You can go right here to our menu bar, click there, and they're on sale now. Now here we've got our pad bank section here. And so we've got A, see it's a red light. We've got B, C, and D. And you notice on the software too as well, it's accessing each one of those banks. Now right below the pad bank, there's a little orange notation. So it's E, F, G, and H. Now in order to access those banks, we've got to hold down the shift key. And our shift key is right here. Then I'll hit the A bank, and now it becomes E. You notice on the software, now it went to E on the software. And also, you'll see the light right above that A there. It's not red it's amber now so go to B B becomes F C becomes G and D becomes H right next to these four pad bank buttons we have the pad assign button and I'll press it here and notice it turns red and what happens here is the pad assign button helps you to set the display up so you have the ability to assign samples to any pad. So I can hit a pad and assign a sample to it. Now it has a second function as well too. And that function is to copy pad data. So for example, I would hold the shift key down and then hit the pad assign button. And now I can copy data from one pad to another. Here's our main screen. And I'm going to press pad assign now. And now we can see the matrix here for our pad bank. You'll notice that if I move the cursor, you can see the names of each one of the sounds that correspond to each pad. Move the cursor up, and we're in the program. Now, in order to change the program, we just turn our data wheel, or we can go plus or minus with the data buttons, as you'll see here. I'm going to hard soul, now we're going to head crack. Hard soul and back again to this program. Now we'll go back down. I'm gonna hit a pad too. Hit a pad. And that pad's there. So now we want to assign a pad to a different sample. So got this here. Turn the data wheel. New sample. Plus button. New sample. Minus back down. Got a sample right there. That's pretty cool. Now Suppose you want to copy data. Okay, you got this dope beat you're making up. And you want to copy these two hi-hats of two separate pads to make one a flange and one a regular. So, I would just press Shift. Then we're going to press that pad assign. And now we see this. Now, as you see what it says there, it's pretty simple. It's copy pad. Then it says from pad. So, I say that pad, A15 two pad this pad right here see that we can't see that happening so you gotta go down so you can't do it by just hitting it notice that so you have hit the pad here and you move your cursor down to two pad then you want to get that pad so second hit it and now it's there now once it recognizes that you have these two different pads and you want to do it just press do it and now They're both the same sound. 